and welcome back to my channel, Beautiful Tangled Mess, and welcome to my second video dedicated to St. Patrick's Day. And for today's video, I am doing another segment of Lip Free Dine Hard. And today, I am going to be tasting one of Ireland's most famous drinks, in my opinion. I don't know. I didn't research it. The Irish coffee. And I'm going to try it today. I'm going to do my best to make it with the ingredients that I have. I don't think that I've ever tried to make an official Irish coffee with the cream on the top, but I'm going to show you the steps that I took. And if you want to see the actual steps that I use, you can go to the video that I will link down below. And here's a little preview of it. It is from Jamie Oliver's drinks tube channel. I love that channel. There are so many varieties of drinks on there. Super nice. And Jamie Oliver is one of my favorite chefs. <laughs> so let's get to it. Let's make this Irish coffee and let's have a taste, shall we? Well, that failed. All right, so here's the finished product. <laughs> it looks nothing like the picture on Jamie Oliver's website because I kind of failed at getting that top cream on there because as you can tell, I had to improvise on a lot of the ingredients, but I didn't mix it like they said not to do. I added Irish cream and vanilla whiskey and half and half, so I'm hoping it tastes somewhat similar. And I'm gonna have to practice putting that whip stuff on the top because like, I couldn't do it. It was awful. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, it looks like a lot, but I think most of it's coffee. <laughs> yeah, I'm totally Irish, aren't I? Far from it. I'm Italian. <laughs> anyway, okay. Live free, die hard, everybody. That is not bad at all. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> that is really good. Oh my gosh! <laughs> wonder if it would taste good if I put one of these peeps in it. No, I'm not gonna do that. Those are nasty. Mm. I feel like I'm in Ireland again. <clears throat> oh, I shouldn't do that when there's whiskey in there. Oh, I'm feeling the whiskey now. <laughs> the whiskey is not really overpowering because I added some Irish cream in there. I don't know what it would taste like with Bailey's. I think I've tried it once before, but I really like Irish cream a lot. And I'm glad that I paired it with the whiskey in this drink. I wanted to try this drink for you because it's it's St. Patrick's Day, and I wanted to do a special video with my special leprechaun hat, which I got in Ireland, by the way. In Dublin's fair city, where girls are so pretty, twas there I first met my sweet Molly Malone. That's all I remember of that wonderful song. I have to rewatch my Irish vacation video. That was it for my Live Free Done Hard episode, the St. Patrick's Day edition. I want to wish everybody an amazing happy St. Patrick's Day and a very special happy birthday to my wonderful husband. I can't believe he was born on St. Patrick's Day. I'm so lucky. <laughs> If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you have any suggestions for drinks or any weird foods that you want me to try on this channel, please leave a comment or a suggestion down in the comments below and I will take a look at them. You guys are awesome. Don't forget to sub... I keep banging this thing. I have to be careful. This is my favorite picture that my friend made for me. You guys are awesome. Don't forget to subscribe and I will see you in my next video. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Happy St. Patrick's Day. Oh. I'm a leprechaun cause I have a leprechaun hat on. 
So I realized a couple hours ago that I totally forgot one of the ingredients in my Irish coffee. And yes, I think I was saying Irish whiskey the entire time I was filming, so I'm sorry. But I made another one. <laughs> this time with all the ingredients, so let's try it this time. Ooh, that made a difference. <laughs> it's really good. Yay! I still couldn't get the cream part right, but oh well. It's still good. <laughs> 